So the first slam of the season under our belts, we are looking ahead to Wimbledon and of course the Russian and Belarusian ban at Wimbledon that is set to continue in 2023. It could change, a lot of pressure is being put on for them to change it. And a lot of pressure is being put on by former champions, including John McEnroe, who's come out and talked about whether or not he thinks the Belarusian and Russian players should play at Wimbledon this year. So this is what Mac had to say. Obviously, this is a horrific situation which is going on in the war and people deal with it in different ways. I disagreed with it last year that Wimbledon didn't allow the Russians and Belarusian players to play. I would disagree with it this year. I don't know what they're going to do. It's a situation that no one wants. So hopefully something will change that allows the players to play. It happens that in our sport, some of our top male and female players come from those two countries. They shouldn't, I don't believe, be punished for something that they have nothing to do with. So that's what John McEnroe had to say about the situation, and he was against it last year, and he's gonna be against it this year. Wimbledon is the only tournament outside of, I guess, team competitions that players aren't allowed to play. Uh, we just had a Belarusian player win the Australian Open, and she played against a Russian-born player in the final. Did you find any problem with that? Let me know down in the comments below with that as well. But of course, a lot of players from Russia and Belarus are very big contenders at places like Wimbledon. Of course, Sabalenka just won the Australian Open. She's probably going to be a favorite for Wimbledon. Medvedev, I believe, is going to be a very big contender at Wimbledon if he can play. But let me know down in the comments below. Do you think that they should be able to play at Wimbledon this year because the pressure not only from former legends and former champions is mounting, but it seems like a lot of pressure from people in general and the public. We all want to see them play. But let me know down in the comments below. Do you want to see the Russian and Belarusians compete at Wimbledon this year?